Surviving the plane crash was just the beginning. Only half of David's life vest was working. So after eight hours of swimming without any help, the 26-year-old was starting to get cold and weak. I may have been the one strong in the beginning, but overnight I wouldn't have made it without her. Um, there was a point where I was getting abdominal cramps and I couldn't kick anymore and I didn't have my hands. And I was telling her that and she's like, just hang on to my ankles. And so that's what I did. And I tried to kick as much as I could, probably wasn't doing much, but she tugged me for a good hour, hour and a half. But Sydney's strength was tested as well. Overnight, the 23-year-old was attacked by jellyfish, stings that still scar her arms weeks later. So I was like, okay, I'll take a jellyfish sting over a, a shark bite. <laughs> Turns out sharks weren't too far off. As the pair slowly made their way to shore, they realized they weren't alone. We're on his radar. He's looking for us. He's I'm either sure, going to wait yeah. for us to get real weak or he's just, I don't know what he's doing. He would go behind us, I would turn, and then I had my feet ready to just kick him if he came close. I asked him, I said, so what are you going to do if it, if it does? And he said, I'm going to look it in the eye. And that's all he said. And I was thinking in my head, okay, I don't know what that does, but whatever. I actually don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> the pilots covered 20 miles before they were rescued by the Coast Guard 21 hours later. It was my will to live. I just, I knew that that was not my time. I was too young. I, you know, we, we survived the plane crash. We survived the night in the ocean. We, we cannot go down before we get rescued here, even if we had to save ourselves. We just both knew we were going to go back and just be a family. The pair says they were determined not to give up. For me, I'm amazed at how much we overcame and did out there. You do know that people are calling you guys the miracle at sea. Yes. <laughs> We're extremely blessed to, to go through that, and it is, if you look back on it, like a miracle. Um, and it's due to every, everybody giving their prayers and thanks.